Well then, good afternoon, boys and girls. Another Hardy Boys production. Thank you very much for clicking on this video. If you like it, uh, subscribe, hit the bell. Bing, bing. Uh, whereabouts are we, Chris? We are in the Hot Hope Valley. Hot Hope Valley. GV8 Hills. GV8 Hills. Yes, we're doing another hill camp. Uh, we've enjoyed the last ones that we've done up at... Um, Oh, where was last week? Hall Bottle. Hall Bottle. Hall Bottle Crags, that was fantastic. We've done Tossing Hill, that was good. Uh, so now, we're still in Northumberland. I like your style. Hey! <laughs> oh, indeed. Don't you hope the jokes get better? Oh, they're not. They're not. I've got to get over it myself. I think, once again, I'm caught in far too much gear. I felt the weight of the... The, the rucksack's getting out the, uh, the car and uh, I pick it up with one hand. Mine's a ton weight. What am I doing wrong? Wait, everything I've brought I'll use. Aye, right, back the way I was. We've got the uh, Hardy Boy number one, Hardy Boy number two up front there, and uh, Prentice Hardy Boy blister at the front. Young Stephen. Paul can't make it. He's still isolating. He's caught the leggy. And Gary can't make it because I think he's he's got a tiddlywing competition on or something. Yeah, <laughs> uh, so he can't make it. It's about 28 degrees, maybe. Uh, and I'm sweating already. Uh, I've got a canny claim to get up to the top. Ta da! And I think even when we get to the top, we've still got further to go. Yes, but this is a steep part. This is the steepest the bit. Good. Uh, absolutely fabulous weather. Um, so much so, I haven't even brought a waterproof. Are you, Chris? No. And that. It's chancing it, <laughs> but the, so. the forecast is fabulous overnight. So, whew. we'll get up, get up onto the top where it levels up a bit and I can breathe and tack probably. <sighs> and I'll get back there then. So, for now, sign up. Right now, then. Now, then, now, then. We're back again. <laughs> Wide angle shot of the three lads. Uh, yeah. The corner of Chris that there in the background uh, is that the Cheviot, the Cheviot, the that big and high. Uh, that crag there in shot, I think you'll see the thing that what, what is it? Housey Crag, Housey Crag, uh, in that one Langley. is Langley Crag. you up on the top which is fantastic it's just what we want like it's keeping the flies away uh, it's actually cooling me down a bit i hope we've got this for the duration like the breeze the breeze the breeze off into the sunset yeah uh, aye uh, this is a beautiful part of the world we're fortunate i must admit I mean, this is how far? No one. No one. 10, 15. No one. 15 minutes to drive. We co driver there. Yeah. Thank, thank the Lord. I hate driving. Co pilot. Co pilot. Doubles up as a navigator. And backseat driver. Backseat driver. Oh, yes, I. <laughs> yes. Backseat driver. Uh, with random comments, which is. <laughs> that's handy. Faster, uh, daddy's his usual comment. Faster, daddy. Faster, daddy. <laughs> Uh, so in total about how far? A couple of mile walk? A couple, couple of mile walk and then find a, a spot. Pitch with tents. As, as, as per usual we'll get a, a brew on, a bit of nose bag on. Uh, open the bar. And then open the bar hey. a bit later on. Best part of the day. Uh, what's you and Stephen got? Steak burgers. 
Oh yes, poor man's steak. Poor man's steak, steak burger. Oh, you've got the pre-mix duck, haven't you? Aye, that was nice, that eh? It's <laughs> it, it, wondrous. You know, I just, uh, I, I, I'm going to drink it in. Drink it in. You know. Soak it up. Soak it up. So, I mean, what would you be doing now? I'd be, well, I'd be at work the night. I've, I've, I've got the night off. I've took the night off. Um, starting to wear thin now, like working six nights a week and five days a week. Shawnee likes his Saturdays out camping with the traps and uh, just it's nice to be at one with where we live, you know. I mean, I've never been here. Have you? Um, not up this area, I haven't been. I haven't been up this area. But uh, to get out doing a bit of camping, man, you know, a bit wild camping, not having to pay. <laughs> hey! Uh, caught all your own gear in, set up. You know, I have something nice to eat, a few beers. I mean, we didn't get tanked the gills when we were falling out and stabbing each other. And Speak for yourself. Cutting each other's heads up with <laughs> bow shows and something like that, you know. I mean, actually, uh, I didn't need that. Oh, I've brought me little, me little Laplander, so I've got that. I don't know why, like, it just... That, my friend, is why your bag is so heavy. Why? Because you brought stuff you don't need. Well, I might need it. Why? Well, what happens if we get the... Uh... Top of the hill. <sighs> Jimmy and Yeti's not been spotted for years. Right. So, they brought a knife. A little plastic uh, seat or something like that. They brought a, a, a bushcraft knife. Nope. Oh, I brought me more. Uh. There you go. Ah, but you see, that could come in handy. Totally, yes, your knife could come in handy. I mean, if... Uh... Well, I come sneaking into your tent in the middle of the night. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> oh, did I get a big stick? Could oh, you? Did you have a big stick? Oh, oh dear me. <laughs> hey, he's incorrigible. I come away with this, don't you know, every Saturday. Uh, I don't know if the microphone's going to pick up this wind or if it's going to pick up the voices. I, I did see a little bit of footage at um, Donna, Donna Van Senior. She's got a little clip on me. I don't know if that's like wireless or if it's gonna if it's wired or not. I might send a message and see if it would work on my phone. It's worth the shot. Make sure you word it correctly. I will word it correctly, yes. Uh, but the bowl's a little bit easier now, like it's a, a defined path. I mean you can see it's uh, I think it's probably for farm vehicles and that yes, track that. It'd be hard pushed to get a car up here, like. Oh, right. uh, are we through the gate? I believe we're through the gate, we're trying to do Great, I've walked on for five and a half minutes, right? We'll get back to you in a bit. Right then, peeps, the boring bit. We're up here. That's a Fathom, the Fathom 200, and we've got the uh, 
What's he, what, what's he sleeping, Matt? Chris? Trekology. Trekology. You L80. And I've got me £1.50 Tesco's pillow there. And I've got me, me snood over. Hey, best £1.50 I've ever spent. Yeah, I've got me jacket in case it gets a little bit nippy. I've got pants and another top I can put on. It's not going to get cold like it. It's blazing hot up here. It's incredible. But that, that's, that's okay down the boat five degrees that so I, I don't think I'll actually be in that sleeping bag tonight to be honest Same as mine, and uh, you you you've got the, the, the hey, what is it the the fathom? You've got the fathom. Oh, that's right, guys. You've got the fathom four hundred, and I've got the two hundred. Great bags, Emily. Like. That's the trickology pillar. pillar. Marvelous. Look at that. Comfort. That's in it. Very fetching. Lime green. Lime green and grey. We like that. That's nice. Yeah. That's these condoms. <laughs> Uh, there's Stephen up on the top having a bit there, uh, took the boot. And there's a, uh, I don't know if this is for, is this for sheep? sheep. Uh, is this for putting sheep? There's plenty of sheep muck lying about like. The last resident. The last resident. Oh dear. Come a cropper. Oh lordy lordy. Yes, that was lordy. supper last night. Last night. <laughs> last night supper. <laughs> uh, but I just think a purpose built sort of. And I think what we'll do, we'll make as well utilise it and we'll cook in there. I think that's going to be the best bet. It's it's windy in there, like granted, but... Uh, I, I think that'll be alright for the view. Absolutely superb. Everywhere you look. 360 degrees. Chris, give it to you. So we like Bill Bramble. Could, could well be. I know we're over a thousand feet above sea level. Yeah, but yes, a cunny pitch. Cunny little pitch, that. Yeah. Really, what more can you say? There's no bugger else here. I think it's about time we've got a brew on. What say you, young sir? Yes, definitely. Aye. Oh, right then, I shall nick off an hour and we'll bring you back a bit later on. I don't know if we're going to do any footage when we're cooking because that's just. Oh, I don't like doing that, it's boring. I might, I might. Because I've got something a little bit different this week. So we might come back a bit later on. If we don't, we'll bring you back later on when the bar opens. So, tear up an hour. Right, well, I wasn't going to bother, but I thought, seeing as I'm here, we've got the chicken tikka in the pot there. That's cooking. No, no, I'm cooking it through there now. It's marinated. I've got my Uncle Ben's pure rice heating up my boiling water, and then I'll use that boiling water to make a cup of tea in the day my pots. And I've got my garlic chilli garlic chilli sauce there it's like a, a bit of a bulky that's gonna go into the chicken Who's once that's cooked chili? through sweet no it's uh, no? proper garlic right. so that's that and Chris is having burgers and lentil curry oh, and no, lord only knows what uh, anyway that's it my chicken's starting to cook there nicely so I'm gonna add the sauce and I'll speak these later tally bye right then you won't hear me, but you will hear the wind. Um, slightly more wind than we ex expected. Chris said it was going to lessen. I've just checked the forecast there, and we're going to get gusts of about 30 mile an hour. 
but the tents are holding up quite nicely uh, this bit footage is going to be noisy I can guarantee it but that sunset's going to be absolutely phenomenal you know that that's what we've got to do that Yes, that wind is uh, not horrific, but it's, it's constant. I mean, you've just got to look at where we've got the tents pitched. Anyway, enough of that. Back to get back to you later. Right then, uh, I'm back again. You probably won't hear us because it's planning it's plan of free still. Um, but that is the, the, the sunset's going to be absolutely monumental. I don't know if this is going to pick it up very well at all. Um, it's be cheap forward. Hey! I Exactly. Uh, <laughs> that there is actually the, the stuff of dream. Chris, come and have a look at what this looks like on, on here. Elvis juice, two, two tins of Jaipur, and brew dog jagged edge. Top banana, man. Top banana. And there, uh, I've got very, very similar. Very, very similar. But look what we've got later on, boys and girls. Mr. Porky's Pork Scratchings! <laughs> we've had some tunes on. We've been playing all my shit. I don't know what these lads need to listen to. Brahms and List. Mozart's me. Mozart's me favourite. Mozart, we like think of him Mozart. Mozart. back <laughs> what take them glasses up now um we've moved around to the other side of the escarpment because it's less windy route here there's number one there boy. number that? one hot blisters up on the top there Aye. we're for the camera living the dream uh, so yes it's about uh, uh what time is it it's about now it's hot, uh -huh. take two 
<laughs> I've got bugger all. I don't know what happened with that last little bit. I might leave it in, I might not. For the drink happened. The, yes, I yes, think I must have touched happened. something. It wasn't me. It, he didn't no. touch me. No, Hardy Boys don't touch Hardy Boys. Blister's still up on the top there. Blister? In his Hi, little. Hello. In his little. Uh, what do you call that? In his little. Uh, Cove. He's in his cove. He's <laughs> out cove. Yes. Um, yeah, we've moved on here. I think I said that in the first little bit. Because it's less windy. It was blown a holy. Now there's lights down there in the valley. Down in the valley. Oh, the valley. Over there. Over there. Over and there's two red lights. I don't know if you can see them. We're not sure what the red lights mean. But we'll make have a look later. Just in case the, <gasps> you know. Red lights, no, not the shop. Well, yes. <laughs> so as you can tell, bring your credit card. Ooh, bring your credit card. American Express, <laughs> you can do it as fast as you like. <laughs> <laughs> as you can tell, uh, <laughs> we're into the old <laughs> the hooch and the hooch and nanny. Chin chin. What are you on there, young sir? God only knows. I think he's got Brew Dog. We've Brew got oh, Jaipo. 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 Oh, Indian Pale Ale. Hello. Gupta. Gupta. <laughs> you can't see that on YouTube. Sorry for you. Well, we might be able to. <laughs> oh, the police is coming. There's blue light down <laughs> in the valley. In the valley. <laughs> you probably can't see, but there's blue light. They'll be coming seeking us. Us foreigners. They seek us here. Outsiders. They seek, seek us, us there. there. Outsiders. Two red lights over there on the hill. It's either a knock and shop. Leave a light on, on for me. <laughs> Can you hear that? Up again. It's a wind whistling across the plains. You need to see you can't hear it. Right. It's a deep boy. Blue lights getting closer. You're getting a lot closer. <laughs> Put them lights out. We've got blue lights over there. Why, why go dark? Why go stealth? We might have to go a little bit still because there's, there's blue, the, the, the policies wouldn't come across here. They're going to find Raoul Moat. <laughs> Not any one of us. They could be bringing my fishing rod into some chicken. Lake Gaza. Who's coming along to the way we're for? Parked. There's a blue light whizzing its way along there. There is, you like know, not just not joking. There is a blue light. So you mean to say Apollos can get there and we've had to tramp all the way <laughs> up the other side of the hill. Oh, boy. oh he's put his lights out, he's going stealth. Aye. Stealth. Hey, what? No, he's back. Surprised. Well, I don't think that anybody <laughs> in their right mind would want to be tramping up here to chase three Cracker Jacks away from the top of Middleton Tor. Middleton Tor? Middleton Crag. Middleton, Middleton Tor Crags. Oh, Where am I getting <laughs> Tor from? Um. Summit or nothing, them do a lot of tours. I wouldn't class this as an emergency. Aye, there's a few coach companies do tours and all. <laughs> they like Blackpool and places Blackpool like that. Tour. Tour. Like, I like Blackpool, I must the admit. Tour of Loch Lomond. Oh, Loch wall. Lomond. I've got visions of that cop back coming whizzing up the hill with his crampons on. <laughs> <laughs> He'd be walking funny if he had his crampons on, wouldn't he? <laughs> Well, it's not really mountainous. He'd be mincing. Is it? He'd have to bit mince. He'd be, mi <laughs> <laughs> He'd be mincing. <laughs> mincing. <laughs> mincing in his crampons. In his crampons and his ice pick. <laughs> no. I know where I'd like to shove his ice pick. I've got two cans of ale left in the only titchy little cans, but I do have a flagon of whiskey. I can see me being a barrow job again. And we've got, we're going to have to make our way around the other side of the bloody crag. Uh, pardon me, where the tents are. I was planning a gale round there, like. But on the bright side, if we Always up, look on the, the bright, bright side. side Sorry, the... Skipper. If we don't make it round to the other side of the crag, we could always just sleep here. In our pocket. And if we fall, we'll just, we've got a soft land. It's lovely soft ground. It is lovely. So... There's blister we'll up on the rock. Can you see him? Hey. Has he stopped? Right. Then that's where all the mice are. The mice? 
Mason Lakes. Oh, I thought you said Mason Lake of Mason Lakes. I thought Lake. you went past the Lakes. No, I don't them ones, eh? I don't know what's further in the valley. No, I can't see it in the valley. I don't know where um, On a lighter note, I would just like to thank all of our subscribers, all 21 of them. I'm one of them. 22. No, no, I'm one of the 21. He's one of the 21. Um, for click, clicking on this uh, really ridiculous menagerie that we try and shove out as entertainment. Um, a, 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 a mention goes out to Phil West. And to my betrothed, Susie, who well, she's always be by my side. No, she's not. I'm beside. I'm by your side at the moment. He was by my side at the moment. But one of the subscribers who works with my missus, Susie, Phil, he always checks him out. And always has a good laugh. So, I raise really big glass to you, young skipper. Cheers, Phil. Cheers, Phil. Um, and all the other subscribers who are daft enough to click on it. Have you got nothing better to do? Have That's you got no better to do? <laughs> <laughs> uh, if you like, if you like what we do, and you like what drunken ramblings, um, you must be mad. You must be mad. <laughs> Continue to look and check and have a uh, laugh weekly because we're doing every Saturday. Most well. Next ah, week, next, next week, week. you're confusing to the surprise next week. It's not Saturday. <gasps> it could possibly be Morunda. Morunda. Morunda, we're out there. Monday. <laughs> Monday. Yes, because yours truly here is working. Is working on the Saturday. I'm DJing at a location in the northeast. I don't want to give too much away, but it's in Bowling Colliery, it's a colliery tavern. One o'clock till late. Northern Soul, score, reggae, R and B, two tone, all that kind of rubbish. All all played on vinyl. And Anne, can I add a little bit? You can. If you fancy a wild camp, take your tent along. Take your tent along. Because you know what? You know it makes sense. You know it makes sense. Get out and do a little bit of Wild camping. Wild camping. And reggae dancing. And reggae dancing. Yep, yep. <laughs> right. We've waffled on for a good old seven minutes. I'll just put my chalice no. over there. No. Oh, no. it's got a new chalice. Yeah. I'm a new chalice. Uh, no. Can you see it? No, too close. It's the, the beaker of freedom. Oh, the beaker of love. It's the beaker of love. <laughs> 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 the beaker of if he, brings, ups, if he brings you back later on, the, the bigger of love will be gonna, full. We're going to do a little bit of witchcraftery, aren't we? Witchcraftery. We're going to be dancing around this <laughs> lady naked with bacon around our necks. Well, around his neck, and we'll be chasing him. Da, 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 da. It could be breakfast time. Oh, I've got porridge in the morning. And no bacon. So are we going to have bacon around your neck? I stole yours with your rucksack. <laughs> ah, tulip, tulip bacon. You'll have, you'll have a bit of porridge around your neck in the morning. Yeah, <laughs> what, what do you say? What do you say to that? There's no answer. And on that note... Good night and God bless. Good night and God bless. I don't know if we'll come back later on. <laughs> We've still got beer and whiskey left. You never know. We might have a little bit more frottage. Frottage. Not frottage. Not frottage. I'm <laughs> some frottage later. Don't worry. I meant footage. <laughs> <laughs> Where the hell did they get fr frottage if from? If he's lucky, he might get a bit of footage later. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> With that, oh yes, we might come back later on. Bye for now. This truck out on here. Hi. What's the truck? It's on a what the road? It's on an actual road. It's more of a truck. No, it's a road up to the uh, bottom. Though. It's getting dark now. So.
Well then, I'm back again. We've been fed and watered. Yep. Tents are down. Everything's tidied up. We've left it as we found it. No trace whatsoever. So we're ready to ship out. I think that wind's dropped a little bit. Slightly, yes. A little has. bit. It's still blown like. So onwards and upwards. Ready for the next adventure. Until next time, see you later boys and girls.